Happy New Year, folks. Kevin Carroll here with a look ahead to what we're working on for Sunday's edition of The Times Leader. If you or a family member has diabetes, you know just how expensive insulin and supplies can be. I'll have a story in Sunday's paper about a nonprofit group that works with families of children with diabetes to cover those costs and how they want to start working with diabetes sufferers here in our area. My colleague Roger Dupuy will have a report on how the United Way of Wyoming Valley has been working to improve childhood literacy as a means of helping children escape the cycle of poverty here in the region. Our own Derek Lavaris will have a recap of all the action as Penn State lost to Arkansas in the Outback Bowl. And in Sunday Business, Congressman Matt Cartwright highlights funding for abandoned mine land reclamation. Bill O'Boyle has that story for you. As always, folks, we thank you for reading, and if you're not already a Times Leader subscriber, all you have to do is call 829-5000. That's all for now. Thanks for watching, and have a good night.